Time now for Eyewitness News. Call 12 for action. Problem solved. Trash piled up for more than a year in a Fall River backyard. And the family who lived next door struggled to get the mess cleaned up. So they called Eyewitness News consumer reporter Susan Campbell for help, and she joins us now with the story. The good news tonight, the trash pile is almost gone. All day today, garbage was hauled away from the property. The man who lives next door tells me he's relieved. It goes all the way down there, all the way underneath the porch. This is Derek Correa's backyard. Back here is just a nuisance. It's disgusting. I can't stand it. But it's not his trash. We've been trying to clean it up, but there's only so much we can do. The bags of garbage, the broken toys, the old electronics have all piled up right on the property line that Derek shares with this house. Because it's vacant, Derek called the city for help. We've been battling with them for about like a year now about cleaning it up because we have kids, all numerous kids that live in our home that love to come back here, but we can't have them back here because it's absolutely disgusting. We took some of the trash out, but it's just so much and so gross that I don't feel responsible to touch it. So Call 12 for Action contacted the mayor's office and asked who is responsible for the trash. A spokesperson for the mayor tells us the property was recently inspected by Fall Rivers Code Enforcement Office. And he says the city is working with the new property owner who inherited the problem. He said if the owner does not comply, the city will step in and perform the cleanup itself. We expect this issue to be resolved one way or the other within a few days. This used to be. So we checked down. in again Thank with Derek. He snapped these photos for us of the trash being hauled away on Monday afternoon. A spokesperson says anyone who's facing a similar issue should contact the Fall River Minimum Housing Office. If you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1. Our hotline is 228-1850. I'm Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.